find anything. Did you make that up because you're sleepy? No, of course not. <sighs> well, if you're not sleepy, get your stuff together already, Tina, is it? No need to. I wonder if it's a big one, and what are we going to carry it in? Oh, and Tony, where should we hang it? In the park, maybe? <laughs> or maybe we should share it, give everyone a little bit. Tony, are you still packing? This is a serious expedition, Tina. We'll need spare batteries. Well, then I guess someone else will find our star. While Tony's rummaging around, I'll run and fetch the star, then come back. Just in case it really is hot. Now we've got enough batteries to last us a while. Tina? Tina! Oh, Piglet, it's you. What are you doing sitting outside? That's a very good question. No laughing at night. But snoring, well, that's another thing altogether. So I'm on an important mission. I'm off to catch a star. But now I don't know where to look. Oh, no. Don't you stop here. No. I'm talking to my headlamp. There it is. My star. Okay, Piglet. See ya. You said you were going to catch a star? Yep, just think. Soon I'll have the biggest flashlight in the world. Then you won't need that silly little one. The flashlight? Uh, sure. Here you go. Where are you going, star? You. Oh, my star! I found you at last! Ah! Star? I'm no star. I'm just an ordinary hippo. Tony? Tina, where have you been? I looked everywhere for you. I was looking for the star, but I can't find it. Most meteorites burn out in the atmosphere, although sometimes they do actually make it to Earth. But they don't shine and look just like ordinary raw. Tina, where do you find that rock? Oh, over in the park somewhere. Tina, it's a real-life meteorite. So this is my star, but it doesn't even shine. How boring is that? Tina, come on. This is proof that if you don't give up, you can find a star. Ah. Oh? So it does shine. Hmm. Support.
Point Services. <laughs> Thanks, Tina. You really helped me out there. Tony, I think helping is my thing. There are so many people just waiting for my help. Yeah, yeah Tina. Why don't you go help someone else for now? I need to wash off some things here. Great idea! Ah, I have so much helping energy today. Hello? Anyone need any help or support? <laughs> ready or not, Tina's coming to help. Get ready for a world record. One, two, uh, 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 what is that? Your friend Tina's support services is at your service. We'd appreciate your feedback. Tina's coming to help. Friend, Tina supports services. We'd appreciate your feedback. <laughs> Next time, warn me when you're coming to help. That way I can at least put on a bathing suit. But... Huh. Why did I even bother helping them? Not even a thank you. Hi-ho, the dairy oh the farmer in the dell. Rabbit! Of course! That's who always needs help. <laughs> oh. The farmer in the dell. The farmer in the dell. Huh? Huh? Outrageous! Your friend Tina help and support Services. We'd appreciate your feedback. Oh, oh no! What have you done? I helped you harvest the carrots. That's not so bad, is it? Tina, it would have been a lot better if you waited for the carrots to grow first. Tina, help has to be useful and come at the right time. Otherwise, it just makes things worse. Did I really just make things worse? Don't be sad, Tina. Next time, you should just ask how to help. Then everything will turn out great. Tina! Tina? Help and support services? Is that you? I don't even know anymore. I really need some support. Really? Tony, are you with me? Tina's in. Tony's too. <laughs> Do you want to learn how to climb trees? No. Ah! Do you want to build a pyramid out of benches? No. So what help do you need? I need your support so I can pick apples. Uh. Is that it? Yep. Thank you so much, Tina. You really helped me out. Woohoo! Your friend Tina Help and Support Services. Call us if you need help. Water medicine. All right, Mr. Tony. We'll have to give you... Yikes! A water shot. I don't think I like this game anymore. Patient, you have a severe case of wiltosis. A water shot. Quick! Ah! Did you see that, Tony? I'm a real doctor. A waterologist. Now I can cure all the diseases. Tina, you can't cure everything only using water. It's just that no one's ever tried. Huh? What are you playing? Can I play too? Tina, why are you wearing a hat? 
Tony, why don't you have a hat? Well, well. Question fever. A highly contagious disease. Oh, no. Is it dangerous? Oh, oh I survived. Oh, I'd be able to eat ice cream. What you need is water medicine. Drinking water? Actually, holding it in your mouth. Well, any more questions? Still got that fever? That's water power for you. I've never heard of question fever before. You have so much left to learn about water medicine. Time to cure the world. Tina's in. Tony, too. <laughs> It's just... Hang on, Foxy! Mm -hmm. Rescue is on the way! <laughs> Done! We've defeated her hat mania! But remember, no more hats for you, Foxy. I definitely can't wear it now. No need to thank me. <laughs> hat mania? I've never heard of that. The main thing is that I cured Foxy. Mm. Oh, no! Bear is sick! Mm. Bear, get up! Wake up! Wake up! That's what I thought. Sleepy Bearitis. He needs emergency care. Sleepy and wakey, there's no such thing as Bearitis. Tony, perhaps you've come down with hypodatalepsy. Or is this a fit of suspicious osis? Those aren't real. Ow! Pony, your suspicious osis can wait. Someone's really sick over there. The hiccup shivers. Tina, maybe you shouldn't. Hey, rabbit. What? Feeling better? Hi, it seems like they're gone! Thanks, Tina! See, Tony? Water can cure anything and everything. Somebody oh. help! Felicia's tummy hurts! You have rabbit stomach. I can cure that right away. See? It's all gone now. No, it's not! Tina, this is serious. We need to take her to Mouse right away. I've already cured half the cookie villagers with water. <laughs> is it gone? No! This can't be a real sickness. <laughs> Tina, it's very real. We need to get her to Mouse's right away. Is it bitter? Ugh. But at least it's helping. Why didn't the water help then? Water is the source of life. But diseases need to be treated with real medicine. There's no such thing as water medicine. <laughs> but there is such a thing as water attainment. <laughs> <laughs> a loud sign. Ta-da! Ta-da! Have a lovely fancy park here. Yo ho, yo ho. Yo ho, yo ho. Yo -ho. Hey, why are you messing up our park? <laughs> what park? We don't understand. Yeah, we're pirates from far away seas. Arr! Even pirates should know that it's bad to hurt plants. And messing up the path and knocking benches over is wrong. Aww. We just didn't know. How are we supposed to know? We didn't know. Yo ho, yo ho. <laughs> Come on, Mouse. Maybe they really didn't know. Is that so? We need to fix that. <sighs> what are those? Yeah, we don't understand. 
not allowed signs, so you'll definitely know what you're not allowed to do. not allowed. Then it would be a surprise. Really makes you want to do something. Something not allowed. And Mouse's drawings make you want to do it even more. Huh? Huh? Mouse, what's this picture you drew? I didn't draw that. It was... No, no, no. It was the piglets. yo -ho! I didn't see any don't draw signs. <laughs> yeah. It's a lot prettier now, too. <laughs> Ooh. Huh? Great. Now we have to draw the signs all over again. <laughs> Huh? Yo ho! Mouse, Tony and I can draw them if you want. Right, Tony? Tina's in, Tony too! Oh, thank you, Tina. Thank you, Tony. That would be a huge help. Do you need any red paint? Nope. You'll be okay without it. What are those? Ta da! Allowed signs. What's that? Stuff you can do? Yeah, you can smooth out the paths. What else are we allowed to do? You're allowed to plant trees. But are you allowed to not plant them? You're allowed to not plant them. You can think of more things you can do instead. Look, you're allowed to draw. You sure can. <laughs> Doing the wrong thing is boring. It's way more fun to do the right thing. Well then, let's go do some right things. <laughs> Looks like we'll have a lovely, fancy park here after all. <laughs> <laughs> the wildflower! Wild hmm. Now where could they be? I don't understand. How could this happen to me? Mouse! Mouse! Fox is gone and gotten sick on us. What brings you in today? Well, everything's just so boring. I just... I wish there was something to make me go, wow! I don't know what. <sighs> well, well. Mouse, can we save her? Or is it too late? <laughs> <laughs> We'll brew her up some medicinal uh, herbs, and she'll be as good as new. Mm -hmm. huh? Mouse, are you okay? You spilled everything. Oh no, Tina, Tony, I don't know how it happened, but I, I lost my glasses, and I can barely see without them. How are you going to treat Boxy then? <sighs> If I have your help. Of course you do. Tony's in. Tina, too. <gasps> <gasps> Tina, you can gather some medicinal herbs. There's a drawing of them in here. Tony, you can help me find my glasses. Who's that glasses finding hero? Tony, the detective hippo. Oh, the losses we've suffered. My good mood is missing. And so are Mouse's glasses. Mouse, think back. Where was the last place you saw your glasses? Hmm, the last place where I saw them was on my nose. Uh-huh. Well, they're not.
not here anymore. Better investigate. <sighs> Hang in there, Foxy. Tina's coming to the rescue. All right, which one of you is the medicinalist? A cheese plate? Hey, this book is about food. Mouse got it mixed up. How am I supposed to know what to pick now? Whatever. I'll figure it out by myself. <sighs> Mouse, where do you usually put your glasses when you take them off? On the table. Strange. It's empty now. As empty as my heart. Better investigate. <laughs> Well, this must be some kind of boring blossom. It will make Foxy even worse. Ow! That must be a pick-me-not. It's not medicinal at all. The medicinalist herb must be the prettiest one, too. Uh -uh. Ah. Amazing! That must be the wildflower. That's just what Foxy needs. The investigation has hit a dead end. Well said, well said. All of life is a dead end. Ta-da! Who ordered the medicinal herbs? <laughs> I can put this one in the living room, and that one in the kitchen, and the bathroom. What are they called? Wildflowers. Thank you, Tina. Thank you, Mouse. Thank you, Tony. La la la! It's like I'm living in color again. Eureka! The investigation is a success. But Tina, that's not a medicinal herb at all. But it looks like Foxy's better. I guess beauty is a kind of medicine, too. Thank you, Tina. Thank you, Tony. I wouldn't have been able to see it without you. <laughs> <laughs>